Brendan was um, nine years old, he was across the street playing with friends. We heard tire tracks. He was hit by a minivan out front. When Chris was born, uh, he was just about dead. He came a little early, and he came with complications in the delivery. The doctor's words were, don't expect him to walk, don't expect him to talk. His brain, he had a um, traumatic brain injury, brain bleed, and then he had two broken legs. Pretty much anything on the inside was, his, his heart stopped for over 20 minutes. He spent, um, I think it was 30 days, 29, 30 days um, in the unit. And certainly the first two, two and a half, three weeks were just, you know, touch and go much of the time. So I have known that I've wanted to be a physician since I was in the second grade. I had a physician who was a family friend and he um, was just had, had such an impact on my life. And I, I knew that uh, that was just some, somebody that I wanted to emulate. Regardless of whether you are bringing a new life into the world, having emergent care, having a hospital experience, or experiencing a death, Sparrow is family. And family for our patients, too. And I think that our patients feel that from us when we provide that all the way around. They brought their A-game, they brought their best, everybody. I mean, it was always clear that they were fighting for him as much as I would fight for him. If he would have gone anywhere else, they wouldn't have been able to meet his needs. He was, he had less than a 1% chance of survival. My son would be dead if they weren't there. I mean, honestly. And with that low a percentage, you need to be on the top of your game. You need the best of the best. I've trusted Sparrow with my children. I've trusted them to be able to birth my baby girl and my baby boy. And they're wonderful. They've grown up and they're healthy and they're happy and doing well. Uh, without the services we got there, um, it could have had a disastrous uh, outcome. Well, he's run marathons, started two companies. Uh, he's a bio, serial biotech entrepreneur. Um, uh, was, you know, Phi Beta everything in college. Um, uh, won a Hertz fellowship to go to MIT. He's back to himself. He's running like crazy. I am most proud of the fact that Sparrow continues to grow and that Sparrow continues to listen to the needs of the community and change with those needs of the community and continue to be the best place to, to work, the best place to, um, to come to get care. Well, there are things that communities need. And one thing they need, a uh, community needs, is good health care. But everybody has something to give. And we all know, you know, it's time, treasure, and talent, or work, wealth, and wisdom, or however you uh, categorize them. It's not what you do for yourself, it's what you do for others. I see Sparrow being the trusted place. I see it the, being the place that everybody looks to. When, when they see the place that they need to go to for healthcare to seek healthcare, they're going to say, I need to go to Sparrow to seek my care.